Alright, so we just left the road from Mom's house at 6 o'clock. We plan to leave at 5.30. Small hiccup, but we can manage. Because Taylor made us a care package. What I'm not looking forward to is driving in the car for six hours with this lady. It's gonna, it's gonna drive me crazy. We'll be lucky if we get both get up there alive. <laughs> One of us is going down. On Pismo Beach. That's where it's going. Yeah, we're going to we're going to do it. Is there anything you want to say to the initial trip? No, I don't. Okay. So this is where we're stopping to eat for lunch or breakfast since we voted not to have Taco Bell. It's not terrible. It's not the car is like trip long, it's been this. Anyways, we're eating in a train. Hopefully we don't get robbed. Mm. Oh, so Ashley said we should wear really tight fitting clothing. <laughs> and now look what, freezing her butts off. <laughs> Johnny got overzealous with the doom buggy. And Double now we're train. stuck. Too cool for the dunes. Your knees digging us out. You can handle me. We're stuck in this big bowl. We don't have cell phones. We don't know what time it is. Uh -oh. <laughs> Sean can't get us out of here. <laughs> here, we're gonna do a two phase. What do you want me to do? No, because you're stuck. What am Look I? How drenched in we are. That is so stupid. What are we? <laughs> Look at our wheels. How do we get out of this? <laughs> oh, now the help comes. Way to go, help. We have freed ourselves from the buggies. Sand trap. Using the one, two, three method. Why am I even buckling? No, you have to buckle. Why? This is dangerous. Put on your buckle. Riding with you is dangerous. Why? What am I doing? Screaming. <laughs> do you want me to not scream? No, it's fine. Look at that dude. Would you scream if you went down that thing? Yes, you would. Pull your car! Woohoohoo! How do I get out? This is what just happened. <laughs> Ashley's been driving for about maybe three minutes. <laughs> she's not she's just steering actually. I've been driving. My feet <laughs> and she thinks it's a super cool idea to go up this steep hill. <laughs> I'm like, this is gonna be bad. So we get up. <laughs> we make it to about like right there. <laughs> and you can see the divots and we get stuck. And we're like, oh poop, that sucks. Yeah, man, as we're pulling it out, trying to get it unstuck, we hear this hummer coming up over the hill. <laughs> like a dinosaur, it just comes racing over. And I'm like, Ashley, run! And I, and I take off. And I'm like, oh crap. And I look back. Poor Ashley was standing like three seconds earlier. The hummer was parked, hitting, impacted against the Humvee. And then I pull the Humvee, or the... I pull the buggy up underneath it and it starts rolling down the hill. I were Ashley standing, so I'm like, Ashley, run! <sighs> she does a dive. They barely escaped their lives. Was overall, Lied about the dangers of the tomb buggy. That was an incredible experience. You know what? This is a life experience. Seriously. You're gonna remember this when you're 30 years old. You just bonded. <sighs> I would like to think I tried to save Ashley. No, you didn't! But I just turned you around and ran. You did not try to save me at all! I yelled, watch out, Ash! The Air Force man ran all by himself down the dunes and left the five foot two girl who can't even reach the pedals of the dune buggy 
for herself. Uh, uh, and then the jerk in the Hummer said, sorry for scaring you. Yeah. I have my moments. Like, pure stupidity. I think to myself, are you educated at all? Ashley's been driving the dune buggy for a full 15 seconds, and it's stuck. Yeah! <laughs> so, Ash just ran through the birds, and she came back with poop on her foot. <laughs>